Hello, dear traders. I'm Maria Stradop, and this is the review of Crypto Analytics from FX.co. It's the 14th of September today, Thursday, and in our today's review, uh, Gary Gensler made uh, some unpleasant comments on crypto industry again, and uh, what's happening with Bitcoin and Ethereum and their technical picture. And we have uh, two articles today by Sebastian Seliger. Both of them were written yesterday. And we, ha we will start with news and um, then uh, talk about Bitcoin. Uh, so, uh, the news is about uh, the relationship, let's say, between uh, the US Securities and Exchange Commission and the crypto market. And uh, recently, Gary Gensler, chairman of the commission, reiterated his warnings against the crypto industry during the Better Markets Conference. He believes that failure to comply with regulations could impact not only investors, but also the broader financial system. And uh, he noted that the number of people injured in the crypto industry reaches millions of people. And uh, he also expressed concerns that problems in the sector have the potential to impact the broader financial system because they could undermine investor confidence, which is ultimately the most valuable currency. And... Um, also, uh, Gary Gensler criticized a celebrity support for cryptocurrencies and attempts to exploit differences in regulations and laws in different jurisdictions. However, he added that no, uh, to, that no re new regulations or laws needed. Um, we, as he said, we have the recipes. These are the laws that Congress has passed, whether it's anti-money laundering and sanctions, whether it's the securities laws, whether it's Commodity Exchange Act. We have the laws that Congress passed and that is enough. They were his words ultimately cautioning the crypto industry and beyond Gensler expressed concerns that failure to comply with applicable regulations could have broader uh, implications for the economy. Okay, uh, and now let's get to technical picture. We'll start with Bitcoin. So Bitcoin American dollar pair has bounced a new swing high, a swing low at the level of 24,000 towards the technical resistance at uh, 26,512. Nevertheless, the bearish pressure is strong as the momentum has hit the extremely overbought levels on the four hour time frame. The short term outlook for Bitcoin remains bearish as the market keeps making lower lows and lower highs. The intraday technical support is seen uh, at level $25,000 and the intraday technical resistance is seen at $26,512. Okay, let's have a look at the chart of Bitcoin for the moment. It's the 14th of September. The Bitcoin opened today the point 26,226 and now it is trading at uh, 26,290. Well, it's uh, step by step, uh, Bitcoin is approaching uh, its uh, nearest uh, technical resistance. It's quite far, really far from uh, the nearest technical support and um, just just below uh, the technical resistance, which is at a level of 26,512. Okay, now let's uh, get to another article by Sebastian and talk about Ethereum. So Ethereum American dollar pair has made a new local low at the level of 1,530 and then immediately bounced back. The bounce high was made at uh, 1,636, so uh, the short-term trend line resistance at the 4-hour time frame was broken. The momentum uh, broken to the positive territory as well, so the bounce can continue towards uh, the level of 1,664. 
The intertechnical resistance is seen at 1,632 and the nearest technical support levels are located at 1,616 and 1,580. Okay, let's have a look at the charts of Ethereum also. And uh, it opened today at the point 1,608 and now it is trading at, at 1,618. Um, well, Ethereum is uh, now really at the uh, first technical support level, which is at the, at the level of 1,616. It's really, really close to it. And, um, but, well, it's not very far from uh, the nearest technical resistance as well. And uh, we remember that Sebastian said that it could jump even higher to 1,664. Well, this is all for today. We will see each other tomorrow in our next review. Uh, as usual, I wish you to have profitable trading. Have a nice day. And uh, see you next time. Goodbye.